districts and what you've accomplished in the last 10 years and what you've accomplished that has changed me in the last 10 years and, and where I was 10 years ago. And I thought about where I was 10 years ago and I thought that if I was in a room of people in West Michigan and I shared who I was, I would probably feel like I was at an Al-Anon meeting <laughs> and say, um, hi, my name's Teresa and I'm a progressive. <laughs> and uh, I'd look around to make sure nobody else saw me say it. And now, because of the efforts of amazing women like you, I can now say loud and proud, I am Teresa Tomey, and I am a progressive voter in West Michigan. That's right. Um, I am so honored and inspired by the work of these women. I came to know many of you through the uh, WOW rally that we did last year, and of which I was also honored to be a part. And so, in in order to um, try to demonstrate my appreciation and the, and the inspiration that you have provided for me, I thought I want to do at least a little something um, beyond the ordinary to uh, express that gratitude. And so I thought for the first time, and the last time ever, you are going to hear from me a little spoken word. So I'm going to try this off script. And I'll take my glasses off. Tonight, we congregate to celebrate 10 amazing years, to appreciate our founders, our supporters, our donors, our volunteers, to illuminate our work, our programs, and our endorsees most impressive. And a mission that did activate an agenda in West Michigan that is, in the word, progressive. And... My job here is to facilitate, and while doing so, I might gesticulate so that I invite you to contemplate the work that the PWA has done to populate the political landscape with women and men who ameliorate, look it up, these communities in their United States, in our United States. And now we know, 10 years ago, the status quo did perpetuate the myth that progressive women could not create an agenda and a mission that would resonate in this conservative place, but woe to them. <laughs> woe to them who underestimate the power of those who did and still do menstruate to move mountains for their cause. <laughs> yes. The cause to influence public policy through the election of candidates who advocate action through reason. Remedies with dignity and protection for choice. So, let me reiterate, to make sure you get this straight, that we are here to jubilate. Except for Verna, she's here to intoxicate. <laughs> that we are here to jubilate. A mission that has, for 10 years, and for many more to come, will radiate as an instrument of change. Thanks. Woo!